Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. This video is going to be an update for the hashtag roulette pan collab that Rebecca and Alexi created. This is round eight and this is my third update, I think, maybe my fourth update. It, it'll be the title of this video anyway, so you'll know. But I have actually hit goal on another item, so we will be rolling that out and rolling something else in again. And this will be the last update before the finale in January. So I need to think about things that I'm going to get done in one month basically. The first item on my sheet was number four and that was a dupe and I picked from the Squeeze Me Makeup Obsession eyeshadow palette which is a like a monochromatic nine pan palette that is a dupe of all the monochromatic nine pan palettes that exist now and I wanted to hit pan on this shade here and as you can see I've not done that yet but a dip is starting to form. I mentioned recently about this eyeshadow that basically it's really pigmented and I only need a little bit of time and that means that I can't really get too much progress on it in one go like I can't overuse it because if I overuse it then it's just too pigmented on my skin so that's going as slow as it's going basically. The next one was your most expensive eyeshadow and I went to the Too Faced Natural Lust eyeshadow palette because it's my most expensive eyeshadow palette and I wanted to hit pan on this shade here in All Tied Up which has not hit pan as of yet which has not hit pan as of yet, but there is a huge dip in there. To be honest, I was kind of hoping that I would hit pan for this update, but it's gonna take probably another update and then it will have the pan. So by the finale, that one will be done. The next one was a product that was passed on to you. And for that, I picked the Revolution Pore Blur, Blur and Prime Primer. And I was complaining about this before because it didn't seem to be making any progress and going down in the tube in terms of like, I don't know if there's an air bubble or something, but it's just not getting any lower if I fold it down like this it's not any lower than the last time but I have actually been using it so I don't know if there's air in here or if it's just very heavily compressed in terms of like the product but I am still working on it and we will just see where we get to it was brand new when it went into the project and we are still at this blue mark here the next item was an old cult classic and for that I picked the Maybelline color sensational lipstick in the set in the shade 630 velvet beige and it is just this really kind of brown nude shade I love this lipstick I adore this lipstick but unfortunately I've not been reaching for it just because I, I don't know I've just not been reaching for brownie kind of or even warm enough tones that I would warrant a lipstick like this I've kind of been reaching for the icy eyeshadows this winter and normally I do a lot of gold and red but for some reason this time around I've been more like icy shades like purple I have purple on my nails right now I just I'm all about purples greens and icy things this winter and I don't know if it's because normally Normally at this time of year I would be full into Christmas spirit and this year I'm kind of struggling with the Christmas spirit a little bit so that could be the reason or it could just be a random thing that I've changed my likes over the years so who knows but I will try and work on that a little bit more and the last item is the one that I actually hit the goal on and that was somebody else's pick and Erin picked this for me this is the I Heart Revolution Light and Glow highlighting palette and I was choosing this shade here and I wanted to hit pan and as you can see I did actually do that there is a teeny tiny bit of pan right here so I'm calling that one done, which means that I get to roll another number. So I have my phone here. I'm gonna just bring up Pretty Random and I'm gonna roll between one and 100 because that is how many items are in the thing. And randomize and I get number 86, which I've had before. So 47, 47 I've not had before. And I'll go and look up what that is on the spreadsheet. So I've picked my item. Number 47 was a product that's some kind of lotion. So I picked this. This is a hyaluronic hand cream that I was sent for testing purposes that's why it doesn't have any details on it it just has the details of the study I guess you can call it the study is over now so it doesn't really matter and I have this much left so I think that I could get this done between now and the finale in January so this is the item that I'm going to put in for the item that I'm rolling in number 47 a product that is some kind of lotion and the last item was one that I rolled in last time which I've not actually used yet and that was an item in a pastel shade and I picked this nail polish in the shade quick as a bunny it's kind of like a grey nail polish Um, I won't show it up close because I've not actually used this yet so it's still brand new but you guys said that I could go ahead and use it as a pastel shade and that it does count and you would probably do the same thing so that is what I'm going to do and hopefully I will get some use out of this after Christmas 
kind of when the holiday period is over I've stopped putting purple on my nails and I'm reaching more towards blues and greys. And that's everything for this project. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you are also doing this project so that I can catch your update. I am behind on a lot of videos so if you watch me and I've been commenting on your videos because I watch you and you're like where's Claire gone? It's not that I'm ignoring you guys it's just I have a very busy schedule especially with work coming up to Christmas and I've not had a chance to sit down and binge watch your videos basically which I will do at some point probably over the Christmas break when I'm not going to be working and you will hear from me then on your videos. Jessica can account for that because I commented on one of her videos from September the other day that's how far behind I am so please bear with me if you're waiting for me to comment on your videos because I always try and comment so that is that. Thanks so much to Rebecca and Alexi for creating this project once again and I will catch you guys very very soon. Bye!